Okay. This is the book that I found. Um, it may be out of print right now, but I'm not sure. Um, I found it on someone's website and um, it had their PDF format of it. Uh, so I'll try to find the website as well as credit, um, cre credit the website as well as crediting this person, um, Andrew Loomis. Um, okay, let's get started. Um, I'm just gonna use my watch as a timer. Um, let's see. Do, do, do. Let's see if y'all can see that. Okay. And I'm gonna do, I know I said five minutes, but I'm gonna do 10 minutes. Cause I'm thinking or should I do five? I'm gonna try 10 minutes, okay? Okay. Yeah, I should've, well, wait, okay, let's see. Okay, there we go. <laughs> you can tell I'm new to this particular watch. 10 minutes, boom, okay. First thing, I'm gonna draw a circle. And I will say like some things I'm pretty good at drawing and then some things I still struggle with. And one of those things is portrait drawings. And to be honest, sometimes I can draw a circle better than I can at other times. Um, so that's something that I'm gonna be practicing as well making sure the circle is even. Um, okay, so first thing, we're gonna kind of shade this in. And this is in no way a tutorial for portrait drawing. Um, I guess in a way it is, but we're learning this together, so that's why I don't think of it so much as a tutorial for portrait drawing. Um, And if you, if you all choose to, you know, join in and do this, please, please make me feel good with joining my Facebook group and posting um, your work. Because uh, obviously there's no reason to be embarrassed. If I can come on and do this in front of you all, we're all friends here friendly community. Okay. So then they did a, well, we don't have to do the little um, shadow part, but it looks like here's the little place to put the little stop thing. And I drew a little something right there. Um, and this will go to right here. Okay, and then I don't know, I do feel good about this. I feel like if I practice this every day for 10 minutes per day, or if we all practice it 10 minutes per day, will definitely be better than what we are right now. And I meant to try to go lighter because I, I tend to be kind of heavy handed. And if we go a little bit lighter on the drawing, then it'll be easier to erase when you make mistakes. Okay, so this part says a brow line. Yeah, that looks a mess. Okay, I'm gonna draw this in there. And then this goes like right 
here, I guess. Eh. I just got to follow the picture. So I guess this is depending on which way you're going to turn it. which way you're going to turn the man's head, I mean, so if we were to stick a little stick right there, it would come out right there, and then we're going to yet again, drawing too heavily, but I'm going to think positive. That's another thing we're going to work on is even though when you're struggling with something new and you want to do like a really good job, not bashing yourself as you're learning, you know? Does anybody else have that problem? If so, please comment below. Um, make me feel good. I'm not the only one. <laughs> okay, let's see. And this. Ah. Okay, don't get aggravated, no big deal. And I might try some different authors. I probably will see which one I can learn best from. Um, sometimes it just, just depends on what you learn or how you learn it, I should say. And this part is kind of like cutting that head through. And I'm not sure where my larger eraser is, but it's somewhere around here. I gotta find it. This is more for like fine, you know, fine, fine um, erasing. Again, try not to get aggravated with yourself. Try to give yourself patience. And I mean, just like you won't get aggravated with a child that's learning something new, you won't, don't get aggravated with yourself. Cause you know, you're not gonna get it perfect the first time they didn't either. So. And although I'm telling this to you, I'm telling this also to myself because I have a tendency to just be you know, like, ah, it's too hard. Um, but it's not too hard. We're gonna get through this. We're gonna learn this. We're gonna get it. We're gonna learn how to do it. So now I'm gonna do this one. And this one's like, looks like it's going down like that. And then drop that line. And then somehow it turns again. So maybe this, I'm not sure. Maybe this part kind of goes here. Now you see why I added the extra five minutes. This is just gonna look a mess at first, no big deal. It's the first day, and we're doing it. I'm gonna try it with this one. I'm gonna try just, instead of drawing all these extra things in there, I'm gonna try just doing a regular circle. Yes, that one's not the perfect circle. It doesn't matter. Um, <laughs> okay, it matters some, but 
We're not gonna make too much of a big deal. I'm gonna try starting from here. And I see like a line going across this way. And then a line going across this way. And this is a man's head, by the way, according to what they said. And they being the author. Um, I'm gonna draw the ear. And the jawbone. Okay, it's not turning out exactly like I want it, but that's okay. That's okay. We're we're learning, you know. It takes time. It's no big deal. Everybody calm down. <laughs> And it's time to stop. <sighs> I know. Okay, it's 10 minutes, so we're gonna stop. And also, I guess it's a good way not to get frustrated with yourself, you know? I don't know if anybody, if if y'all are pretty good at like not getting frustrated, but I, I have a tendency to get frustrated when I'm trying to do something and I want it so badly. I want it so badly, like right now and I need to learn how to be more patient with myself. So hopefully this is gonna help a lot because this is something I really want to learn how to do. Um, but anyway, I'll see you all tomorrow. We'll work on this some more. Um, I'll probably just start it over again a little bit um, and try, try again. We're gonna keep on trying. We're gonna think positive, we can do it. As my little cup says, my mug says, believe in yourself. I don't know if y'all can see that or not, but anyway, thanks for watching. Bye.